Hello everyone. Today I've got something different for you. Fallout 4 is one of my favorite games ever. So I decided to build one of the deadliest creatures in the game. And I hope the giant skeleton just chilling in the background is not going to steal the show. I'm totally gonna be highlight of this movie. By the way, I'm holding this battle axe like a guitar. Why is no one talking about me? I'm getting most views on the channel. I'm going to break that record. What about me? Oh come on. You're hardly getting any views. That's harsh. Guys. Let's not get sidetracked here. People want to see how the Deathclaw is built. Deathclaws have very muscular and strong arms. I use different slopes to emphasize these muscles. Also used modified plates so the arm can make all kind of movement. I'm not satisfied with these white claws, but I'm limited with the pieces I have. Here's how I built the legs using wedge plates and some Technic pieces. Tail is actually really simple to build. Some modified plates to connect each other, some slopes, and there you have it. When building the torso, I used inverted slopes at the bottom and regular slopes on top. You have to plan where legs, arms, head and the tail will go. When I was building the head, I tried to keep it simple but also true to the original. I really wanted these horns to go to the sides. So I had to do a little cheating with empty space inside the head. Otherwise they would sit straight, which wouldn't look so good. Alright, let's assemble this guy. In the meantime, I have a favor to ask you, click that like button, and subscribe if you haven't already. For those who are wondering, Giant Skeleton is still the tallest mock in my collection. Thank you for watching.